and she's half finished. One side is completed, and there's um, a layer of dried paper mache on here. Um, it's on top of a piece of wax paper, um, the wax paper and the bin of paper mache that you'll be using um, are on the white cart with the paint uh, close to the door as you come in to the room. Um, so I'm just going to do a little bit on the other side here, which is still just tape. So her taped surface is pretty smooth and ready to be paper mache And so the process of paper mache is um, you... Um, have your figure on the wax paper. That way, the wax paper kind of works like a drop cloth and it catches the drips of the paper mache. And then, when the paper mache is dry, the um, sculpture won't stick to the wax paper. Then, to do the paper mache, you just take a paper towel from the towel dispensers up at the sinks and then tear up your paper towel into little pieces. And then, um, you just all you have to do is get the um, paper towel a little bit wet. You don't have to dunk it in. It shouldn't be like really soaked or or really, you know, like dripping. It should just be it should just be a little bit wet. And then just move it into position and then make sure that oh, make sure that the surface of the paper towel is um, entirely soaked. And then you just leave it on the surface like that and then um, go around the surface of the figure and then uh, cover the whole surface with uh, your little paper mache uh, stickers that you make out of the paper towels. Once you're done with one side, if it's still wet, you can flip it over and you can work on the other side um, and it'll, it'll um, stay on the wax paper and won't stick. Uh, I'll show you, Will is working on this uh, fisherman, and so he's, he did some paper mache yesterday, and so now he's going to finish up today. He's got some places he needs to patch. Once the paper mache dries, especially in uh, places where like um, the arms and legs are turning, you're going to see that the um, corners of the paper towel will peel up, and you can see where you might have missed a spot, because it's kind of hard to tell. Um, when the paper mache is wet, uh, if you've missed any spots. But you'll see once it dries, you can tell um, where you need to patch it. So Will's job today is he's going to maybe trim off some of these little corners that are sticking up and then go around and then just patch up um, his, uh, the, um, the missing spot.